Hey, what's going on, guys? It is your boy Addicted Blue here, and today I am bringing you guys Weapon Setup Guide Episode 3, Part 3, whatever you want to call it. And on this episode or part, we are taking a look over the Shiva. And before I start going over the gun itself, I'm just gonna let you guys know this is a semi auto, so it's not full auto or bur burst. And if you guys don't know what semi auto is, it's basically when you press the trigger to shoot, it only is gonna shoot one bullet. So let's go over the gun. Uh, this is an assault rifle, as you guys can see. And for the first attachment, we are gonna be using a red dot sight. This is the one I go for every time because it's simple, it's my favorite. But you guys have the choice to put recon, which I don't like. But if you want, you can put very X if you zoom in a little bit. Elo, which is like an iron sight, so if you want, you can use that. You can put thermal on it if you want that. I never tried thermal in this game, but I might. So these are the options you have. I'm just gonna go with the reflex because that's the one I like the most. For the second attachment, I am using grip, not quick draw because it doesn't. It's the same thing, but personally for me, grip is better because it reduces the recoil. So and the quick draw is. I don't find it useful on this gun. I would rather put another attachment than put grip and quick draw. So on this time, I went with the grip only. I usually go with grip and quick draw, but I'm going to only go with the grip this time because of the second attachment I'm using, the high caliber, because it increases our damage by two. You could either use FMJ if you like. It's really gonna make no difference because the stats are the same. And the high caliber, what it does, is not just gonna help us with our damage, even though the damage is really good. We're gonna get two extra bar for damage, but also the high caliber increases the damage on headshot. Meaning, if let's say you need a three shot on the head, you would only need two. But with this gun, it's usually three shot on the body and the opponent is dead. So that's why I do recommend this gun. Another attachment you could use that it helps out a lot, but me personally, I don't use it. But you could use it if you want to. And that's gonna be long barrel. If you don't like the range, then long barrel it is. Now, I haven't actually tried going with rapid fire because it's a semi-auto, so I don't I don't know if that's gonna help out at all. But I'm gonna go and try it out, and then if it's really good, I might make a updated video so you guys could have the best class setup for the Shiva. And the rest of the attachments are just fast mag, extended mag, laser sight, stock, suppressor. That just if you want to. I'm not gonna recommend the suppressor because it's gonna bring our, our bring down the, the range and the damage a little bit. So I won't recommend suppressor, but if you wanna go stealthy playing S and D searching the sword, you know, maybe you could use it. Laser sight, your choice. So everything other than the grip high caliber and a reflex that's what i recommend you guys to use that's how you're gonna bring the best out of this gun the rest of the attachments are optional for you guys thank you guys so much for watching drop a like if you enjoyed and subscribe for daily top notch black ops 3 content this has been addicted blue peace out